the United Arab Emirates. Situated along the eastern flank of the Arabian Peninsula is a stunning country of contrasting landscapes. From the sculptured beauty of desert dunes to the lush mangroves of the coastal wetlands and undersea realms of the Arabian Gulf. The dugong, which inhabits warm coastal waters, is a marine mammal. Its spindle-shaped body can measure up to four meters in length and weigh up to 400 kilograms. Dugongs swim using their fluked dolphin-like tail and maneuver the paddle-shaped front flippers for balancing and turning. They are usually shy and slow moving, but can sprint up to 20 kilometers per hour. With small sunken eyes, dugongs have poor eyesight. But despite the absence of external earlobes, their larger internal ears enable them to hear extremely well underwater. Grazing in shallow waters is their principal activity. This species, one of the few herbivorous marine mammals, feeds almost exclusively on sea grasses. For this reason, dugongs are commonly called sea cows. Seagrasses are not true grass. Rather, they are submerged flowering plants, which complete their entire life cycle underwater. Seagrass has a very low nutritional value, so dugongs must consume vast amounts of it, up to 30 kilos a day. As mammals, dugongs must surface to breathe, and their valve-like nostrils are located at the top of the flexible snout. They are capable of staying submerged for six minutes or more, but usually surface more frequently. Surprisingly, even though dugongs spend their entire lives underwater, they are most closely related to elephants. The dugong's closest aquatic relatives are the manatees. At first glance, dugongs and manatees appear similar, but there are distinct differences between them. Manatees are different structurally and also their habitat preference is different from uh, dugongs. The dugong tail is a uh, fluke, it's like fish, and manatees have spatula-like tail. They use fresh water and uh, dugongs are more marine in nature. The Arabian Gulf has long played host to an incredible display of nature. The marine sanctuaries of Abu Dhabi help to ensure that dugongs, which have already survived in the wild for millions of years, continue to live on as the gentle giants of the sea. <laughs> 